welcome back guys uh, today we are going to see a different concept till now we have run the uh, feature files using just run feature option of uh, cucumber so today we are going to see how to use the runner class with uh, in the cucumber framework so i have bifurcated the pages in the pages the runner class and the step definition files into three different packages and my features are in a different folder so registration flow dot feature is there which has the code that was there earlier no changes and the new changes that are there are test runner dot java so in this test runner let me expand this one what i have is it is a very simple java class it's a java class basically and you have this run with option here what run with is doing is it has the parameter of cucumber dot class so this is a mandatory uh, annotation and after that i have the cucumber options in the cucumber options i have the location of my features file where my features are located so they are located in a folder called features that's why i have mentioned as features is equal to in inverted commas features then i give a comma and then i say glue glue is equal to org dot cucumber dot step definition all my step definitions are in uh, org dot cucumber dot step definition package that's why i have mentioned it here and just uh, keep in mind to uh, put this in inverted commas and enclose them with braces then put another comma and put format equal to html colon reports you can have json also here this is for basically generating the reports a different reports folder will be created in your uh, at uh, on your hard di hard drive and uh, there will be an index.html which we will see later once we run the uh, once we run this uh, framework it will generate this reports folder and in that there will be a index.html which we will explore okay so right now our uh, feature file has just one scenario which we will be running for registration and then we will be asserting the registration confirmation page uh, no changes in steps.java uh, so let's run it so i do a right click over here i run as and i run as j unit test so it will start running now the chrome browser is invoked and the site is loaded the url is loaded register is clicked data is entered and submit button is clicked the final assertion is done and we are done so it says one scenarios and it says 17 steps 17 passed and it took a total of 22 seconds to execute this test let's go ahead and look into our uh, folder so let's i will show you the folder where the reports got generated just right click on the project and do a refresh once you do a refresh you will see a reports folder over here and it will have a index.html so i will open this on the hard drive it is already open over here i do a refresh and you see a index.html right over here i double click on that and it gives me a, a report like this where it mentions the background and the scenario in green color that means this has passed when i write uh, when i click on it it says given i am on new tour site so basically it is listing the uh, feature file over here and it lists uh, it shows the color what is the color of the uh, test execution so if it is red then there is some problem now it is green so there are no problems you can also have uh, json formats i'm not covering json formats uh, you can look it up on the their official website it's pretty simple but uh, rather than having json formats people prefer index.html reports and there are other features also like uh, when you integrate cucumber frameworks with jenkins there are certain uh, plugins that help you generate pretty uh, good reports 
pretty graphical reports so that's it for now for this tutorial thank you very much for watching do subscribe to my channel and do keep watching my videos thank you